morning folks, morning, welcome to Saturday. And we're here up in Aberdeen, um, doing a couple of chores today. Uh, I had a day off traveling my train yesterday. Had a nice game of golf and a, a kind of a chill out afternoon. And uh, I'm up here today in Aberdeen to pick up a few bits and pieces for my, uh, my balcony. Um, I don't know if you wanted the scenario with my balcony on the side of my house, it kind of half fell down, so I had to get it all fixed and uh, now I'm trying to get it all sorted for the summer. So, I'm trying to pick up a few bits and pieces up here in Aberdeen today. Sorry about the noise down here, I'm down at Aberdeen Docks, taking a wee shortcut down to the kind of the beachfront. Um, yeah, so the train journey today remind me never to go on a train journey when there's a football game on. It was Aberdeen versus Hearts. I was actually going to head through Edinburgh today again, but with the rugby being on, um, I thought, nah, it's going to be too busy. So anyway, the train from well, Arbroath up to Aberdeen was the Edinburgh train coming up the way. I was full of Hearts fans and then those Aberdeen fans got on as well. It was total carnage, folks. The train was just like a drunken brawl. It was funny. It was quite good to watch, quite entertaining, but it was absolute pandemonium. I felt sorry for the, uh, the student, not student, the, the conductor rest person and the train driver getting so much uh, stick. Anyway, um, I'm on a quick walk down the docks because down here and on the beachfront, allegedly, um, there's a new cheesecake place that's meant to have the best cheesecake in the world. So we shall go and investigate and see if it lives up to the hype. And then we'll cut back into town get all the few bits and pieces that we need. Right, there's an old bar, 1821, the Fitty, the Fitty bar. Not football, Fitty is the name of the old town here in Aberdeen. We get down to the um, harbour bit here to see there's a big tugboat kind of going out there, which means there's either a boat coming in or a boat going out. So. We'll try and make it in time. Well, folks, we have a ship coming in, and there's one currently sitting down there, I think, waiting to go out. They're only small ships, like the ones you see at Ferry Den when I'm down there. So, uh, we'll just hang around here to see them uh, maneuver into, into and out of the harbour. You can see there, way in the distance, that's the uh, Silver Darling, that's a posh uh, Aberdeen restaurant, that's the new control tower, and uh, above me, we have the old control tower which used to be controlled by red and green lights. Yeah, this is the old uh, control tower. It's not used anymore. Right, the ship's coming in quite quickly, folks. You can see it there. Here it comes. That's the Scan... Is it Scandi something? Scandi Caledonia. We've got a flag on the back to see where it comes from. Probably Norwegian. Uh... Uh, the wee village of Fitty, Foot of D, and uh, yeah, we're down the beach now. There's no sand today, the tide's right in. Let's see if we can find this cheesecake van. A few up here, they're not quite busy, all of them. The other way along here, there's uh, burger vans and different types of food options. So we'll go and check it out. 
That's Project Pizza in that one. Got uh, coffee and hot chocolate in this one. Waffles. A little surf cafe. Ritz on the beach. There's another one. This is a food something foodori beach hut. Foodori. Dog burgers and sandwiches and salads in this one. I think this could be up here, folks. This little van, next one up. Looks like it's got a sign saying cheesecake. Cheesecake shop takeaway. There it is. The strawberry cheesecake very nice presentation and then we have the uh, bus highlander bus takeaway like actually setting folks upstairs on this one Island uh, uh, double decker bus cafe and takeaway. It's awesome, folks. Went upstairs, very nice service. Service was really good, actually. Uh, and the food looked awesome. Didn't buy any food, but the four that were sitting kind of opposite me they had uh, burgers and chips. Only about seven pounds, I think, for the burgers and chips, but it looked really good. And uh, yeah, nice view of the sea, a nice coffee. So give the Highlander bus cafe place a good nine out of ten, folks. Very good experience, very enjoyable indeed. Better than Starbucks, it was. It was just spotted up there, look, Didi's again. I think that's a franchise from uh, Clyde Bank. I'm gonna investigate. It's beside the uh, the orange. Or is it the range? The orange. Right, Didi's, let's go and investigate this. This is Aberdeen uh, Beach if you're interested. It's actually a lovely beach in Aberdeen. But it's been a, a big city. Having a beach on your doorstep, very unusual. But this is Scotland for you folks, kind of beautiful. Right, so then it's, I think actually it's just because it's, uh, I think because Aberdeen's on the D, that's maybe why it's DD's. I don't think it's the same as uh, DD's in yoga. You never know. Of uh, trees that have been washed up, folks, in the storms. It's a whole tree. There's some more up here as well on this bit of beach. I think there's another skateboarders going here. Aberdeen. What's that? 
turned out to be a really nice day so far, folks. Nice little breeze, it's quite warm now. No sign of rain. So, um, yeah, I did pick the right destination to come to today. Because again, it was a matter of looking on the map or the weather chart and seeing where the driest place was. And today it was Aberdeen, top corner, Scotland. So uh, yeah, so far, we've been lucky. Some more graffiti on the beach. In this part of the beach, this is the back at Fitty again. Um, we've got an old bell from the was it the old foghorn bell? Not the obelisk thing in the middle, it's a big uh, sewage kind of well, shaft, if you like, underground tunnel, folks. I think it's a big boat just about to come out here. Look, see it emerging from the side there. So there it goes, folks. Austin's, Austin's Joe, don't know. I think it's Norwegian again, probably. And there it goes. There's the uh, old bell. Hogsand, oh, I've been there, folks. Hogsand, that's in Norway, on the fjords. I've actually stopped there. Hogsand. There it goes. A lot of boats in and out today. Then it goes. So there's the cheesecake folks, I've taken it out of the box. I'm just trying to get stuck into it right now. So thank you so much for watching today and I uh, really appreciate it and we'll catch you again somewhere soon.